Show my options, play the best of three. Hello from 2K Sports. We're honoring diversity and culture tonight with the NBA celebration of Noche Latina. Hi, everyone. I'm Brian Anderson. Alongside Grant Hill and Clark Kellogg, our reporter is Ali LaForce. And a quick look here at some of the numbers for Luka Doncic. Over the past 10 games, his effective field goal percentage has really taken a tumble. In layman's terms, his offense just isn't as well-rounded as it could be right now. And before we tip off here, it's time to hear from our reporter. Hey, Allie. BA technology is moving faster than ever. The new thing? Collectible highlights trading online. The players are taking notice. Shooting guard CJ McCollum said, quote, a lot of players are inquiring about it. I've grown closer to the non-fungible tokens, trying to figure out what moments I should buy. Guys, he's a believer. Boy, he is a big thinker, no doubt about that. Good reporting there, Allie. And a look at the starters for the Knicks. Barrett plays the small forward with Randall in at the four. Evan Fournier is out there with Kimball Walker. And it's Robinson in at the five. And for Dallas, Kleba and Porzingis, the combo inside. Luka Doncic is out there with Trey Burke. And it's Hardaway in at the small forward position. And deep into the season now, Grant, are you noticing any trends that may just become a permanent part of the game? Well, I mean, of course, B.A., the fast pace of the NBA is here to stay. And players of all positions are continuing to develop deeper range from the three-point line. And the foul called on R.J. Barrett. That's his first, That's his first foul. First team foul. on D. Burke on the wing. Five on the clock. He takes it in. Lays it up and banks it in. Now Walker. An aggressive player on offense. Scoring around 16 a game. Randall a screen on Doncic. And the layup is good. Not just a jump shooter. Walker also pretty athletic and athletic enough to get inside and finish around the basket. Doncic outside. Driving inside, and he banks in the layup. He's taking it right to the rim, and no one was there to greet him. Well, this early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. Now here's Walker. Barrett a screen on Doncic. Walker passes to Barrett. Hits the trifecta. And the floor awareness of Walker impressive there as he got the ball to the open man. Here's Burke. Outside Hardaway. Let's the three fly. Randall pulls down the board. And he probably thought he was going to bury that one. Pass to Walker. Outside Barrett. Walker against Doncic. Over to the wing. Here's Randall. Can't get it to drop. And it's Dallas the other way. They defeated Utah in their last game. Yeah, they hit the court last game with some serious attitudes, especially on offense. And you know, confidence is key there. They seem to play with a ton of it, especially on the offensive end. Starting to find his rhythm. He's cooking, and he knows it. And you know what? They're going to keep using it. I mean, he'll be the centerpiece of their offense today. You can bank on that. Here's Walker. Hey, and that explosiveness of Walker is sometimes just mesmerizing. Quick-footed guard with a superb shooting stroke to match. Dallas Fowler. Kristoff Porzingis. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the Knicks. Kemba Walker taking two shots. Free throw good, Walker. The Mavericks making a switch here. Bullock's checked in. Free throws good for Walker. 
He's as solid as it gets from the line. I mean, give him the opportunity. He's cashing in on those. Here's Bullard. Fournier covering. Doncic against Walker. And it's Doncic missing. That's exactly the look they wanted, guys. Right guy, right play. Wrong result. Doncic against Walker. Randall a screen on Doncic. Outside for Randall. Six to shoot. Walker against Kleba. And again, the Knicks missing. The Mavericks have gone three of five shooting so far. Pass to Doncic. Kleba outside. To the middle. Kicks it to Doncic. Porzingis with a screen on Walker. Doncic passes to Porzingis. And the three off target. The Knicks with the lead. Well, you know, coming off knee surgery last season, Porzingis got off to a slow start, literally. And he struggled to move his feet defensively and even offensively he struggled. It takes a lot of time to get back to full strength when you're coming off that much missed time and that kind of injury. Now here's Barrett. A steady force on their offense. Recording around 14 and a half a game. The three, Hardaway. After missing his first attempt, now one for two. Encouraging to see Hardaway Jr. knock it down from there, proving he can do damage from this area. Mark, it was rumored that the Mavericks explored the market for Porzingis last season. Well, we know how good he can be when he's healthy, B.A. The question has been, can he stay healthy? And that's been a challenge for him thus far, and that may have led to some of Our those rumors you heard. Three These points. teams have really gone back and forth. <laughs> yeah, five lead changes already. This one's going to be a battle for sure. To the inside. Here's Porzingis. Walker pulls down the board. New York has gone two of three from three-point land so far. Pass to Fournier. Oh, great D that time from Kleba. The Mavericks trailing. Hardaway with it. Here's Bullock. Back to Hardaway. From outside the arc. It's hauled in by Robinson. Well, the Knicks shooting just 38% so far in this one. Pass to Fournier. Wide open. Chalk up two there. And the quick release of Fournier. Man, he's so good at getting his shot off as soon as the pass reaches his hand. Ladies and gentlemen, your Mavericks dance team. will go for a different look here. Brown, he's checked in for Porzingis. Finney Smith comes in for Kleba. Brown, he's checked in for Hardaway. And Brunson is subbed in for Doncic. Noel, he's checked in for New York. Quickly comes in for Walker.
The Mavericks have gone four of nine in this one so far. Brunson against quickly. Here's Bullock. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. And it's Brown off the drive. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. That's his first personal foul. It's going to go on Nerlens Noel. Yeah, really left him no choice there. He had to foul and keep him from converting the easy bucket. Two shots. Shooting two. Free throw good. Brown. Powell, he's checked in for Bullock. Burks, he's checked in for New York. Rose comes in for Fournier. He makes one of two that time. New York has gone two of three from three-point land so far. Here's Rose. Blocked. Like seeing Powell flex his muscle on the defensive end. Really good at timing his jump to block the shots. Outside Finney Smith. Here's Powell. That one falls. And that makes it a tie ball game. Just owning the painted area. If it's working, no need to change. Rose against Brown. Randall outside. Gets his second attempt to go. Now he's one for two. Put your head down and go to work. That's what they need to do. Yeah, these teams trading punches right now. I mean, it's table tennis. Back and forth we go. Pass to Brown. Outside, Finney Smith. Down to five on the shot clock. Let's it go from 11. That went off the back iron and out. For New York, they've gotten five of 11 shots to go. Rose outside. Quickly outside. Randall outside. Mavericks with a rebound. Outside Finney Smith. Pass to Brunson. Outside Brown. Brunson against Randall. Back to Brown. Jacks up a three. Noel with the rebound. The Knicks with the lead. Rose, the pass to Randall. And it's Dorian Finney-Smith with the foul. That's his first That's foul his of the game. Holly Stein, he's Second checked in for the Mavericks. Coming on to the floor for your Mavericks. Brunson against Rose. Yep, count it. Derek Guys, Rose. how about the ball handling by Rose there? Showing you a little bit of the back to the future Rose with those moves. Powell outside. And he lobs it up. Trying to go for a lob there. Excellent defense and anticipation to stop it. They get the rebound. From down in the low post, it goes. And now it's a six-point New York lead. Well, I don't think there's any question about it. They came focused and ready to play. I mean, they're doing everything they can to um, put things in their favor. You earn that, and they're actually earning it well right now. Count that bucket. He does not lack the confidence. And he shouldn't. I mean, this guy is a dangerous scorer. Quickly finds Rose. And here's Quickly. Six on the shot clock. Called in by Brown. Dallas has gone one for five from deep in this first. Struggling from that area. Pass to Cauley Stein. 107 left in the first. 
Finney Smith shot is off. The Knicks have gone 7 of 16 so far. From deep, Rose. And again, yeah, New York with the triple. You've got to take Rose seriously from there now. I mean, he's capable of doing some major damage from distance. Outside, Finney Smith. Back to Brunson. Inside. And the dunk to finish it off. A oh, beauty. A strong finish to cut into that lead a little. Man, left no doubt with that one, Grant. Well, I tell you what, he loaded up as much power as he could behind that two-hand. Now here's Rose. Pass to quickly. Randall against Brunson. From deep, Rose. Got a hand on it. Brown inside. Checked by Randall. Rose against Brunson. Nineteen footer. Deflected. Well, you can't go up weak against Randall, otherwise he's gonna block him. And that does it for the first quarter. Nick's out in front. They lead by five. And we'll be back in just a minute with the start of the second quarter. Ladies well, a lot of excitement around the Knicks under Coach Tom Thibodeau. All-star Julius Randle explains how he's made them better. He genuinely cares about you as a human being as a person. He wants to see you uh, really excel as a player, and he knows that the only way to do that is through the grind, through hard work, through putting the hours and the effort in day after day. So that's his thing. Um, he's going to push you, push you in practice, push you in workouts, and uh, he's your biggest fan when you're out there on the court. Well, we knew how demanding Tibbs can be, Grant, but that personal touch is that something new? No question. I mean, it's a feature of coaches nowadays. He's learned at every stop and understands it can't be all business all the time. And thanks again for tuning in. If you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter of action so far. All right, guys, some stats here. The scoring breakdown for the Knicks. Boy, the three-point shot has really been dropping for him early on. Also, their passing has been terrific in the first half. They'll be happy with all those assists. They've got Moses Brown, Kristaps Borzingas out there with Tim Hardaway. Then it's Reggie Bullock, and it's Doncic in at the point. That's the lineup out there for the Mavericks. Walker's shot is off. The Mavericks trailing. You know, for all his skill, and he's got plenty of it, one thing that people don't realize about Doncic is just how strong he is. And he's still uber young. With time, his frame will only get more imposing. And that's bad news for the rest of the league. Really nice job moving the ball around that time, picking apart that defense. Noel with a screen on Doncic. Walker passes to Noel. Now Fournier. Back to Noel. To the paint. The kick out to Fournier. New York, no good that time either. Hey, and at 6'7", 230 pounds, Luka Doncic has the physical tools to attack the paint. And because he's got that body and those skills, he doesn't shy away from contact, B.A. If anything, he knows exactly how to use that size and strength to his advantage. Here's Walker. Oh, it's blocked by Porzingis. When a guy has a 7'6 wingspan like Porzingis does, it's just tough to get away from him or get by him. That allows him to block a lot of shots. No, no oh, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Real smooth, guys. Great job with the tip in. Those are the kind of plays on the offensive glass that can tell you a lot about a player. Yes, they can. They can't allow him to beat them to too many more of those. Second chance shot. And that one's good. Porzingis. Porzingis able to use that 7-6 wingspan to full effect, beating everybody to the board, and then quickly cashing in. Robinson finds Fournier. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Second personal foul. Grant, your dad played pro football. 
You think that players who grew up around pro sports have an advantage? Yes, B.A. Obviously, being around a professional athlete, understanding the dedication, the sacrifice, the work that goes into it, really, I think, helped me at an early age as I was developing in a different sport. Good from Fournier. Out of France, the sharp shooting Fournier, an important player to this team because of his scoring ability. Second free throw, no good. Dallas has gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. Pass to Bullock. Porzingis with a screen on Barrett. Here's Bullock. And the rebound goes to the Knicks. Walker's got five rebounds in the game. Robinson, a screen on Doncic. Walker passes to Barrett. And there's the drive. Sinks his third bucket. He's three for six now. Well, the defense allowed that one. He had a clear path to the cup. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. checked in these are not the teams to challenge at the rim the best in the NBA in shot blocking number five the Mavericks they're quick to help each other and they have some tremendous athletes with a nose for the ball Here in the second quarter, just under three and a half minutes played. Here's Bullock. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. A nice shot by Doncic. You know, often once Luka gets the ball, it's all over. It's all she wrote. He's well positioned to finish that catch and shoot. Now here's Fournier. Not a lot of room. <laughs> Foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. It'll go on Maxi Kleba. At the line for the Knicks, Evan Fournier taking two shots.
That one misses. Second free throw is good. Yeah, they're playing a much more physical game here in the second quarter. Boy, it certainly appears to be the case. I mean, they've spent a lot of time at the foul line this quarter, and that's the result of attacking the rim and being physical. And it's Doncic missing. Yeah, still close, but with their tough play on the boards, we're certainly seeing the effort. Walker's shot is off. The Mavericks have gotten five of eight attempts to drop since the second began. Hardaway, the pass to Kleba, to the middle. Here's Bullock. That shot, no good. Fournier with some nice D. Outside Walker. Shoots over Brown. It's wide right, hits off the rim. Yeah, you know, he hasn't contributed well scoring the ball, but obviously his teammates have. Doncic passes to Brown. Back to Doncic. Here's Bullock. And the foul called on R.J. Barrett. That'll be a second foul of the game. That's two fouls in as many quarters. He may have to adjust his approach now. Finney Smith's checked in for the Mavericks. Brunson comes in for Bullock. Julius Randle's checked in for New York. Quickly comes in for Walker. Outside Brunson. Robinson with the block. And they'll keep possession. Just three to shoot. And it's Doncic missing. You know, he looks a little off kilter to me this quarter. Still trying to find his rhythm. Pass to Fournier. Quickly outside. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Eighth and second chance points. Ninth and fast break points. And they are in the top ten in steals. This is a team that will force turnovers if you're careless with the ball. And working their way into the top ten for second chance points bucket speaks to this squad's commitment to scoring on every offensive possession. They want points every trip down. Free throw drops for quickly. And the Mavericks with some changes. Cauley Stein, he's checked in for Brown. Powell comes in for Kleba. And it's Brown in for Doncic. Burks, he's checked in for New York. And quickly drops them both. Dallas has gone just one of four from downtown so far in the second. Pass to Cauley Stein. Back to Brunson. Ooh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. It's going to go on R.J. Barrett. Despite being the consensus college player of the year back in 2018, Jalen Brunson... Wasn't drafted until the second round. No surprise he's made himself into a quality NBA player. Great IQ and hard work has paid off. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. one falls for him. And two national titles at Villanova for Jalen Brunson. Clark, why do you think he slipped to the second round? Well, it's hard to say, B.A. You know, the draft is more art than science, and guys slip for whatever reason. But if you're a pro and you get into a situation where you can prove how good you are, then you'll hang around in the league. Great college players may not have star potential, but he's truly a longtime NBA pro. Both free throws, good from Brunson. New York has gone three of five from the perimeter in this game. Pass to Burks.
here he goes. Nice D from Cauley Stein. The Mavericks trailing. Right side Brown. Now here's Cauley Stein. Outside Brown. Five to shoot. Beyond the arc. It's hauled in by Robinson. Robinson's got five rebounds in the game. Rose against Brunson. Outside for Randall. Fires the three. Knocks down the triple. Randall's got seven points in the game. Yeah, you know, he's evolving his offense over time, Julius Randle. And I think the coaching staff is happy to see it. They like to see him take and make these shots. Now here's Cauley Stein. Nine points for him in his last game. And here's Brunson from the arc. Nails it from beyond the arc. He's got seven. Man, this is just fun. These teams are trading threes back and forth. Nothing like answering back. One team gets three, you fire three of your own. Boom. Here's Robinson. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Rose into the lane. Can't cash in the 10-footer. You know, even though they have the lead, you can tell he's frustrated with himself that he's not doing more. Pass to Cauley Stein. Outside, Brown. There's the drive. The Knicks pull it in. Randall's got four rebounds now. Here's Rose. And Jalen Brunson gets the whistle that time. That's his, That's his first foul of the game. Tough break for the defense. I mean, he took the hit, but he didn't get the call. Yeah, but he was late to get there, so the referee couldn't give him a free pass on that one. And how about the mobile one block we just saw? Amazing defensive work. What a powerful rejection. He's not wanting them to get an advantage in this competitive game. here at the scoring trend over the last several months for Luka Doncic. I don't think anyone expected to see his production drop off the way it has over the last few games. But I have to credit the defenses he's been facing. They've done their homework and they're finding ways to hold him down. And now he needs to find new ways to beat them. Dallas on D. Four-point game. Handle the screen on Brunson. From nine feet out, just five on the clock. No good off the back of the rim. Dallas has gone two of six from distance here in the second quarter. Puts up a three. Another three for Dallas. You can tell his hustle inspires the entire squad. He really gets everyone so amped up. Brunson against Rose. Randall outside. 
Pass to Burks from behind the arc. Benny Smith pulls it in. Hey, you know, I like the competitive spirit, but when you look at it, I think he rushed that three a little bit because he was trying to get back at his opponent. Holy Stein with it. Brown with it. Now Burks defending. Back to Cauley Stein. Brunson against Rose. Oh, they get a hand on it. And they force the shot clock violation. Great D. Next ball. We are getting deep in the season. Let's see the standings out east. You take a look at the Knicks. Their season's basically over, barring some sort of miracle. New York has got four of seven threes to go so far in this game. Robinson, a screen on Brunson. Rose against Brunson. To stop the drought. And it's laid in by Randall. Randall's got nine. It's been a dominant night for him. Staying productive throughout. Outside Finney Smith. Here's Brunson. Oh, it's blocked. It deflects off the backboard. We've got a nine-second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Rose outside. Pass to Randall. Shoots over Powell. Randall can't hit. Dallas has gone three for seven from the perimeter during the second quarter. Brunson with it. He had ten points in the win against Utah. Over Robinson. Dallas again missing. Now there's an example of good defense beating good offense. And so a close game as we wrap up the first half of play. Knicks out in front. Up three. All right, now let's check in with Allie LaForce. Allie, what do you have? All right, thanks. Tibbs, what do you think about the way this team defended in the first half? We're not bad, but we have to sustain it for the entire game. They put a lot of pressure on you. We got to make sure we're containing their dribble penetration, and then we got to react on challenge shots. The expectations are high for the second half. Thanks, Coach. Thanks very much, Allie. We'll be back soon to start the second half of basketball. Welcome, one and all. Before we hear Kenny and Shaq's insights on that first half, let's look ahead and check out the upcoming schedule. Anything here that catches your eye, Kenny? I just always look at those guard matchups. Shaq said it. You know, the real centers have gone extinct. Don't steal my line, Kenny. I don't want to have to do the Shaq fool on you. We are. And shifting our attention back to halftime of this Miami Heat game, both teams keeping pace with one another so far. I like what they've done on the glass. Boxing out, reacting quickly, playing with an aggressive attitude. They set a physical tone, but now everyone gets a chance to recalibrate. We'll see if this rebounding dominance can extend into the second half. Appreciate you joining us. It's been our distinct pleasure, and I mean that. Let's now take you back over to the third quarter with Brian Anderson. Second half of basketball is upon us, and we may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game we've seen so far. You look at Jalen Brunson, what a contribution. They've leaned on him to provide a lot of offense, and that's how he likes it. And you know what? They've come at him a few different ways defensively, and nothing has slowed him down. The Knicks with the lead. So on the floor for the Knicks. Fournier the two, Barrett at the small forward. Inside we have Randall and Robinson. And it's Walker in at the one. Barrett can't hit. And for the Mavericks, they're shooting only 36% so far in this game. Doncic on the wing. Back to Burke. And stolen by Barrett. Pass to Walker. And stolen by Porzingis. Here's Burke. Oh, can't tie it up as that one misses. Kleba against Walker. 
Randall outside. Misses the three. So it's the Mavericks now. They trail by three. Next up, they'll take on the Rockets at Toyota Center. That kicks off a five-game road trip for the club. Doncic doing a nice job showing him some sneaky explosion and athleticism on that throwdown. Walker and Porzingis with the block. Pass to Burke. Here's Doncic. Money from the wing. Doncic has gotten four this quarter. Boy, once Doncic gets on the roll, there aren't many ways to slow him down. Huge night so far. Walker with it, guarded by Kleba. And the foul called on Kristaps Porzingis. That's his That's third foul, foul of the game. Noel, First he's checked in for New York. Big substitution. Nolan's Noel. Randall, left side. And that one goes. Julius He's shooting five of nine in this one. And saying, you want a piece of this? Randall easily getting the better of that exchange. Pass to Porzingis. Hardaway on the wing. Doncic up top. Here's Burke. Porzingis with a screen on Fournier. Clock at six. The three. They get it back, Burke. It's tipped. One reason this game is so tight is because both teams are hitting the boards with reckless abandon. The battle to a standstill on the boards has really been Evan something Fournier. to watch. And the game's not over yet. We'll see if one of these teams maintains more energy than the other going down the street. Bullock, he's checked in for Burke. A little under two and a half minutes gone by in the third quarter. Kleba passes to Hardaway. Doncic against Walker. It's Doncic with a drive. And Doncic hammers it home. Doncic showing you his smarts there because he really sized up the situation and took advantage of what the defense gave. And he says he needs to improve his game in a lot of areas. But you ask me, Luka Doncic is one of the most complete players you'll find. You know, he's just not taking good shots, not taking smart shots, forcing up a lot of low percentage jump there. And that one's good. Poor Zingas. Tell you what, guys, the aggressiveness on defense just hasn't been there this half. Not like it was in the first. And you talk about the overall game of Doncic. He's a tremendous passer, a tremendous rebounder, and we know he can score. And that's what defines the great players. Even if his shot's off on a given night, he has other ways to impact the game. Doncic. Pass to Bullock. And even after two offensive rebounds, they just can't take the lid off. Fournier, the pass to Walker. Noel with a screen on Hardaway. Tipped away. And here's Doncic. He's got 15. Outside Porzingis. Back to Doncic. at home. That's a terrific play and a good sign. This team needs Porzingis to facilitate as well as score the ball. Fournier finds Barrett. Outside Walker. There's the triple. It's rebounded by Kleba. They need everyone clicking here. Unfortunately, this game has gone the other direction. Pass to Bullock. Back to Hardaway. Kleba, screen on Barrett. Here's Hardaway. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That's his fourth personal foul. When Hardaway Jr. is forcing the issue like that, it draws the defense's attention. And I like his aggressiveness as a score. Let's look at the energy stats, how the hustle game has been going for Dallas. Contested shots and block shots. They're bread and butter defensively. They're giving up no easy looks. I'll tell you something else. The points they've scored on the fast break tonight have been a major factor. And the first one at the line is good. 
You know, for Tim Hardaway Jr., it's the family business. His dad was a pro and an outstanding one in his own right in the NBA. So Jr. knows exactly what it takes to excel at this level. The Mavericks making a switch here. Brown's checked in. And the Knicks making a change here as well. Quickly is checked in for Walker. Hardaway hits them both. New York trailing. Quickly up top. Guarded by Doncic. And it's quickly with a miss. Well, that's a rare miss for him inside. He may have just rushed it a bit. Maybe lost concentration, too. Kicks it out to Hardaway. Brown, a screen on Barrett. Hardaway against Barrett. Just four to shoot. Here's Bullock. Dallas again missing. New York has got nothing to fall from outside in this third quarter. To end the run, Randall rejected by Brown. Hardaway, the pass to Doncic. Back to Hardaway. Doncic outside. Good. He's been great in this one. Nine for 15 after that shot. <laughs> They're really working the paint now. Offensively, it's been a struggle for them. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Ladies and gentlemen, your Mavericks dance team. A different look here. Cauley Stein, he's checked in for Porzingis. Finney Smith comes in for Hardaway. Brown, he's checked in for Bullock. And Brunson is subbed in for Doncic. And the Knicks making a change here as well. Burks is checked in. quickly. Brunson defending. Brunson against quickly. Five on the clock. To win the drought. Oh, Collie Stein with the block. Well, there's the shot clock violation. So they'll turn it over. Here's Brunson. They lead by the biggest margin of the game at nine. Back to Brown. And Brown with the stuff. Woo! Defensively, you can't afford to let him get to the rim that easily. Well, oh, that might be why their deficit is what it is right now. You know, you look at it, the communication is lacking, as is the trust. They can ill afford those types of breakdowns. It won't work. You can't win with those kind of breakdowns. Quickly passes to Noel. Just five to shoot. New York needs to get one up quick. The timer ticks. 
And it's quickly with a miss. It's obvious they're becoming frustrated. Nothing seems to be going their way. You know, guys, no denying it's been a rough patch here. I think they've got to run whatever is best in their playbook to get a good shot. Now here's Brunson. Ten points for him. Brown inside. Noel on him. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Knicks. Ball. First in points off turnovers, fourth in opponent points per game, and they finish top five of the association in blocks per game. Their rabid intensity on this end really shining through and helping to intimidate opponents. And when you turn the ball over against this team, they run it on you. You just can't afford to make mistakes against them because they're the best in the league at converting off turnovers. Ladies and gentlemen, your Maverick Dance Team. in for the Mavericks. Robinson, he's checked in for New York. Rose comes in for Fournier. against Doncic. Robinson a screen on Doncic. Brown with the steal. Quickly against Brunson. Down low. Here's Doncic. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Doncic has got 12 points here in the second half. They're finding ways to get the ball into the paint. Five consecutive buckets. And on the flip side, the defenders have to show more fight on the interior. They've got to offer more resistance here. Now here's quickly. Pass to Robinson. And it's stolen by Finney Smith. Two minutes remaining in the Doncic on the wing. Two minutes. The Knicks pull it in. Burks has got four rebounds in the game. Brown against Rose. Shot to stop the run, and it's good yeah, on the lay-in. Rose has gotten his third basket of the night. You didn't think Rose would back down from some contact now, did you guys? Playing with a high level of intensity. Brunson against Rose. It's Brown on the wing. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Shot clock at three. Shoots over Noel. And it's blocked by Noel. Here's Burks. That one's wide left. Couldn't quite line that one up. Just got to shake it off and move on to the next one. Brunson on the drive. It's hauled in by Robinson. Robinson's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Rose against Brown. 
Here's the floater. Had a chance there to cut it to single digits, but it's off target. Rose against Brunson. Into the lane. Over Rose. Robinson with the block. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. Screen by Robinson. Rose with it. Guarded now by Finney Smith. Noel against Brown. Quickly outside. Shoots over Brown. Misses off the right iron. Doncic outside. Robinson with the block. And so it's the Dallas Mavericks closing out the quarter ahead by 11 points. Their key to consistency has been their dominance in the paint. They've been the more physical team. We'll be right back after this word. a moment now as we take a look at our State Farm assist of the game. And the winner today coming from an unlikely position. It's the big fellow with the sweetest pass of the day. Boy, that's a nice asset to have. It's a huge boost to any offense, too. It adds a whole nother dimension when you've got a big guy that can pass. Come on, man. And one quarter to go in a game that, to this point, has not been an evenly fought contest. Kleba and Porzingis, the combo inside. Luka Doncic is out there with Reggie Bullock. And it's Hardaway in at the three, the small forward. That's the lineup out there for the Mavericks. Now here's Doncic. Randall pulls down the board. Randall's got rebound number eight here already in the game. Pass to Walker. Outside Fournier. Back to Walker. Six to shoot. Knocked loose. Outside Fournier. For three. Barrett fires from deep. No good there. So the Mavericks will take it the other way. Here's Hardaway. And it's blocked. Goes back up. Kleba passes to Hardaway. Here's Bullock. Checked by Randall. Here's Bullock. Back to Hardaway. The three ball. The Knicks pull it in. You know, even though they're on top in this one, you'd like him to be better out there because he's capable of being better. It sure would make things a lot easier, too. Robinson, a screen on Doncic. Walker with it. Now Doncic defending. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Hardaway. How about that strong defensive performance for this half's mobile one block? Yeah, obviously he had the shot well anticipated, able to shut it down with authority. Here's Walker, and the deficit down inside single digits. You know, Walker can be absolutely deadly from mid-range, and he knows exactly how to shake free for the shot he wants. Doncic finds Porzingis. Walker against Doncic, and he drops in the layup off the glass. Doncic has got 14 points here in the second half. Now here's Walker. Kleba with a steal. Throws it up high. Oh, it's Porzingis with the jam. And guys, they know he's going to finish off the lob in style. Porzingis and his teammates connecting on target. Now here's Robinson. Pass to Walker. Up and over Doncic. Nice shot by Walker. Walker. And despite the height disadvantage, oh my, he just attacks that interior. You know what, guys? Honestly, I didn't think he'd win that battle. I mean, that's a lot of height to give up. Here's Bullock. Now Doncic for three. Sends it home from three-point land. Doncic has got five points now this quarter. One triple for him in the first half. Now he's hit another. Outside Walker. There's the three. He drops it from range. Walker, Walker a terrific competitor. More than happy 
to rise up and deliver payback right there. Boom! Time called here. The Mavericks decide to talk it over. Yeah, Coach no doubt wants to use this timeout to review the matchups and maybe make some adjustments as well. Yeah, and I agree. I think there's going to be a new wrinkle in their game plan when they come out of this timeout. Ladies and gentlemen, your Mavericks dance team. to hear what the head coach of the Mavericks said to the team. He said, we've got the upper hand, so let's not waste it. Keep getting stops. Keep finding buckets. So the message is, it's not over yet. Back to you. Okay, thanks, Allie. Quarter keeps moving along. Three minutes gone by now. Back to Doncic. Shot clock at five. Dallas needs to get off a shot. For three, Hardaway. Randall pulls down the board. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. Walker passes to Barrett. To the inside. Here's Randall. And Porzingis with the block. Pass to Doncic. Porzingis sets a screen. With the step back. That one's good for two. And the Mavericks lead by 13. And they've really managed to dominate inside. The play in the paint has gone almost entirely all their way. Outside Walker. He shoots it. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Porzingis has got nine rebounds now. He's been just a little off the mark tonight. Really the story of the game so far. Pass to Bullock. Hardaway against Barrett. Right side, Hardaway. Over Barrett. And the Mavericks getting another bucket right there. They just look so overwhelmed inside. You know, that's why they continue to get attacked. Yeah, I think they've got to ramp up the aggressiveness. If they don't, things are just going to get worse from here. Now here's Robinson. Pass to Walker. Going inside. Over Doncic. The Mavericks pull it in. Porzingis has got double-digit rebounds now in the game. The three, Hardaway. That shot off the mark. New York goes the other way with it. He made a three back in the first half, but that's it. We'll see if he can find his stroke. Randall outside. Fournier with the ball. Defended by Porzingis. Oh, it's blocked by Porzingis! Hardaway on the wing. Pass to Doncic. Outside Porzingis. Here's Bullock. Guarded by Barrett. 
kicks it out to Hardaway. Launches it, buries it from three. A slow start for him, but making amends here in the second half. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. game Luka Doncic this is special we are witnessing a legendary performance here tonight he is like levels above everyone else on the floor something must have clicked for him in warm-ups tonight he's just come out and he has run wild hey these fans love him so much and when he gets it going they respond the crowd's energy fueled his performance Passes to Barrett. Noel with it. Right side, Fournier. Up and over, Hardaway. The shot by Fournier, no good. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. Yeah, you look across the board, it's actually sizing up, shaping up to be a great game. I mean, strong performances throughout, and they've really been strong on the glass. Now, here's Hardaway. Six on the shot clock, and Doncic launches from deep. No good on the three. Barrett passes to Walker. Outside Barrett. Randall, right side. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Mavericks. Here's Doncic, and it's the Mavericks ball. They're on a 14-5 run. Hardaway with a screen on Walker. And it's stolen by Noel. Outside Walker. Pass to Fournier. To the paint. Fires for three. Doesn't go for him. And the Mavericks go on the other way now. He's been ice cold tonight. You know, you look at the scoreboard guys, they really could have used this contribution. Now Doncic, Fournier covering. Fournier against Doncic. Four on the clock. To three, Hardaway. The Knicks with the rebound. To the middle. Here's Walker. Well timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. Walker's got nine points now in the second half. Doncic against Walker. Here's Hardaway. Randall pulls down the board. Randall's got 13 rebounds in the game. Glass heating. Pass to Fournier. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. 
Now Noel. Three, three, three. Now Walker. Poke loose. And it's stolen by Finney Smith. Hard away with it. Doncic left side. Shoots over Walker. And there's Doncic. That's good. On the assist from Hardaway. Doncic has got seven points here in the quarter. New York calls time out. Who wants a t-shirt? Make some noise! Ladies and gentlemen, your Mavericks dance team. Walker finds Barrett. There's the drive. Doncic pulls down the board. Doncic has got four rebounds now. And trying to stoke the competitive balance, Clark. Seems like the new lottery system has been working. I agree with you. Flattening the odds a bit and making it a drawing for the top four instead of the top three. A small tweak that has had a pretty good impact, in my opinion. New York has gotten one of three to fall from downtown here in the fourth. It's safe to say they have dominated this game. The game wasn't even as close as the score says in a great win for the Mavericks. And everything seemed to go their way today. They were firing on all cylinders, Grant. Yeah, B.A., this was the kind of performance you relish as a player. Just a very impressive win. And it was a team effort tonight, collecting their 39th victory of the year. It's been a one-sided matchup. They took the right approach in this season series, finishing with a 2-0 record against New York. And what a huge performance it was for Luka Doncic. Anytime they needed a bucket, they put the ball in his hands and say, go make a play. It was impressive to watch. Now here's Fournier. Randall, a screen on Doncic. And it's Fournier penetrating. Here's Randall. Oh, great D that time from Kleba. Here's Dallas now. They're on a 19-7 run. Fournier against Hardaway. Pass to Doncic. Down to five on the shot clock. Back to Hardaway. Three-pointer. He can't get that one to fall. And so it's the Mavericks taking care of business in this one. Boy, they were something special to watch tonight. And the crowd loving every second of it. It's always a great feeling when you play this well for your fans. This team really showed what it's capable of. And now we have Ali LaForce standing with the player of the game. Ali, take it away. Luca, you played well tonight and your team got the win. Those two usually go together, but what else made the difference? Yeah, I think we had a uh, had a great game. You know, we had a. I think it was a great game today. You know, we step up uh, together, play good defense, and it was a great win. Team defense goes a long way. Thanks, Luca. Thanks, Ali. Great interview once again. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. 
For Ali LaForce, Clark Kellogg, and Grant Hill, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for watching the NBA presented by 2K Sports. We'll see you next time.